Question 11. Write the four missing digits to make this addition correct. Now, the unusual thing here is we're actually given the final answer because we're adding this top row to this second row to get this answer at the bottom here. So this is actually the final answer. We've always got to work in reverse to figure out what the missing digits were. So where does the sum come from to add together to make this answer on the bottom? And if you just treat it like you would any normal sum, so these two digits added together have to make 9. Now that's nice and easy. So 8 plus 1 makes 9. So that has to be a 1. And there's nothing to carry, so we can just move on to the next column. So something plus 9 makes 1. Well, something plus 9 can't make 1. So it has to make something that ends in a 1. And the next number that ends in a 1 would be 11. So something plus 9 would have to make something that ends in a 1, which would be 11. So this is going to be a 2, because 2 plus 9 makes 11. And if you do 2 plus 9 to make 11, you would put the 1 in, and you would carry the 1 to the next column. So 6 plus something plus this 1 has got to make something that ends in 0. So 6 plus 1 is 7. And to make it end in 0, what's the next number that ends in 0 other than 0 itself? It would be 10. So we're trying to make this add up to 10, this column. So 6 plus 1 is 7. And we're trying to make it add up to 10. So we're going to need an extra 3. Okay, so this will be a 3. And that will make 10. So you put the 0 in and carry the 1. Now we're trying to make 9. So 3 plus the 1 I've carried is 4. And we need to make 9. So you're going to need another 5. So it looks like it's going to be 5. Now just as a check, it would be a good idea to actually redo this sum here. To see if you do actually get the answer on the bottom row. So we're going to do this entire sum again and we're going to see if we get 9019 so let's have a look so if I do 5628 and I add on 3391 so 5628 and 3391 if everything I've done up here is correct I will get back to 9019 so let's check 8 plus 1 is 9 2 plus 9 is 11, that's what we're talking about, getting an answer that ends in a 1. So 2 plus 9 is 11, put the 1 in, carry the 1. 6 plus 3 is 9, plus 1 is 10. So again, we're ending in a 0, so put your 0 in and carry your 1. And 5 plus 3 is 8, plus the 1 is 9. So we do indeed get back to 9019, which is what we wanted. Therefore, the missing numbers I've got here, 5, 2, 3, and 1, must all be correct, because the whole thing works out 9,019.